Today in the Manchild Cave, we finish up the wave that we did not know was if it was still going or if there was anything else coming. And we're going to do it with Green Lantern, John Stewart to be specific. Stay tuned. Welcome back, Cave Dwellers. Today we finish up the wave. Yeah, we did not know this character was coming initially. We just thought it was those three bad boys and these two ships. Turns out there was one more that they wanted to let us know. New for 22, Superpowers, Green Lantern to be specific, John Stewart, one of my personal favorite ones. So we'll look back here and ta-da, there he is, standing like he should have always been there. So interesting, there's the John Stewart little thing. You can pause it if you want to, if you don't know any of that. Because you don't want me reading because it's been a day and I, who knows what in the world I would try to say those words were and all that good stuff. So I am using a razor blade to cut open the packaging so I can keep the, uh, I don't need the clamshell, but I like the back of it. So the card stock, whatever you want to call it, because those are cool. Those are super cool. So I'll put that over there for right now. Green Lantern coming with, well, I said first one to come with an accessory, but I mean, I guess you could technically count their capes as accessories. I don't know, but of course Superman doesn't need accessories and Batman, where do you start with him? Does he hold the lantern? He holds the lantern, he does. Even holds it like that, that's pretty fun. I would recommend doing this in a warmer temperature so that you did not break something oh that look at that that flexed already and turned a little bit oh that's scary so there's the lantern very nice so he can hold that and there is john stewart awesome looking awesome john stewart but and of course you've seen this before comes up feels like it comes up a little further than superman's it seems like superman's was right around there but maybe not of course the old round and round and as i spun that i saw boom the green lantern ring of course you got to have that the symbol it, this is amazing looking i love this this is a great character so real you know nothing super crazy with it but we'll take this out of the way one last look at the art on that oh, i love it i want i'm not going over it really because you know what it is so uh you know everything uh something that i did see is uh is there anything else you want to talk about i don't know what else to talk about really because i mean I, I reviewed the other two so there's not much here but this is out of the package so so it'd be fun to Maybe have him flying or something like that. Put him on a stand. I don't know. Just having the whole Justice League. Because, you know, this is... Um, gosh, I forget what Superman... Does that say on there? He's This Superman is from a specific... Uh, specific thing. And so is Darkseid. And... Uh, so is the batman they're all for specific things i'm guessing todd didn't want to come out and do your you know give us the original you know from the that i remember from like the cartoon and stuff like that but uh so far bangers and i did see there will be a flash coming out there will be a oh my gosh I totally blanked out on this. I forget the other one, but then the killing joke. Uh, Joker is coming. So maybe with the killing joke, we're going to start seeing some other baddies to form something. I personally would love to see the Legion of Doom. I'd love to see a Solomon Grundy. Todd McFarlane, if you're listening, and I know you're absolutely not, give me a Solomon Grundy. In uh, the multiverse line would be super awesome, but I'll take it here too. I will buy all the Solomon Grundys because... I do buy all the Solomon Grundys. So, quick little review, quick little shot of all of them together so you can see them. And uh, as they come out with more, this guy right here is going to get them. So, uh, please boop, hit that like button. Helps me out. Helps me able to make videos and stuff for you guys. Let's you know, hey, 
people actually do care they're interested in all this stuff if you like what i'm doing let me know if you don't like what i'm doing let me know over here over on the 417 Manchild page anywhere and everywhere i'm everywhere so uh but for now i'm right here uh, but yes please uh, if you dig these, this is what they look like out of the box together. So they look freaking awesome. So I recommend highly collecting these. If you if this is a nostalgia thing for you, if this is something for your kids, very playable for your children, get them into DC, get them into action figures, get them into whatever drives you to get them into toys and just see the magic watch them play there's not a lot that can break on these they're real simple just like what we got when we were kids so let them play let them have fun i mean you're looking at 29.99 should have been 19.99 but at the stores they're on the shelf for 39.99 i don't know what it is with that but he uh disappeared completely off the uh, website so i don't know if there's a problem or what's going on i kept my receipt just in case if he if it does show oh whoops we made a mistake i want my ten dollars back uh 9.99 9.99 9.99 9.99 9 even he's bigger and they could have easily put 12.99 on there 11.99 you know whatever they didn't they kept it at 9.99 so i mean these are a great way to get your kids into stuff they seem pretty durable there's a lot of playability here Man, that's, I recommend it highly. For me, it's going up on the shelf. I'm going to love it. I'm keeping the boxes, keeping the backs. Great nostalgia for this guy right here. So um, be good to one another. Collect what you like. If, if these aren't yours, you don't like these at all, stay off the internet. Don't bother putting, I don't like this because of this, that, and the other. Hey, man, leave them on the shelves. Or hey, lady. Or hey, he, she, they, them, whatever. Uh, whatever your pronoun is I don't care if you like them buy them you don't like them leave them on the shelf for someone else and hey if you're an inbox collector or you're an out-of-box collector I should say like myself and you find ones with dings and stuff like that buy those leave the good-looking ones for the inbox collectors they do them a favor if the paint work is solid and from what I've seen most of these are then uh yeah pick up the dinged ones for if you're an out of box like me and uh help your fellow collectors out let them know hey tap 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 tap, tap here in the walmart in this town or whatever uh the whole waves there go get them so get these selling if these don't sell they're not gonna uh make any more they probably have the other three maybe in production but if these don't sell we don't get anymore so tell your friends tell people hey pick them up for your children your grandchildren your nieces your nephews all that girls love playing with this stuff too so don't sit and say eh, i ain't got any i got all nieces or i got all whatever doesn't matter girls love playing with this stuff too so get this stuff buy it show todd show walmart we're totally interested in this stuff give us more we need wonder woman we need that flash we need um uh, gosh we need to go deep we need apache chief you know we need <laughs> uh, gosh uh who else God, I, my brain's just going crazy with everybody that could we need alex luther we need a toy man we need you know those kind of stuff so let's get these characters made so buy them love them if you don't like them leave them on the shelf stay off the internet and let other people just gush over them including me so until next time Hit that like button and later.